So open Google Earth Pro and then we will start by adding some elements on this map. To do this, head over to view and then select, for example, overview map if you want to see where you are zooming to and where your map is located on the globe. You can also put, for example, scale legend. This is very handy if you want to see the scale of your map. And you can also activate the status bar. So those elements are very important, especially the status bar where you can see the coordinates when you are moving your cursor. You can see now that my coordinates are in latitude, longitude. So now if you want to change the coordinates from geographic coordinates into UTM coordinates, you can go ahead and click on tools and then click on options. So from here you have a lot of options to choose from. So for us we will go to 3D view and we will go here to show lat longe. So here you can select if you want the UTM which is Universal Transfers Mercator. Just select it then click on apply. And if you want also to change other things like units of measure, if you want to put in feet miles or system default, you can also put me meters, kilometers. You can also change the elevation exaggeration, but for us, the most important thing is to change the coordinate into universe transfers Mercator for this tutorial. And we will click on apply and then OK. So if you come back here to the status bar, you can see that now the coordinates are in meters. You can zoom in to any place on earth and you can see that the coordinates now are in meters. So to make this even more clear, you can also add the UTM grid to know which in which zone you are located. To do so, head over again to view and then click on grid. And here we go. You can see that now you have the UTM grids. You can simply know which UTM zone you are located in according to your study area. So I hope that this short tutorial was useful. If so, please like it and subscribe if you want to get more of this kind of tutorials.